So, you want to become a correctional officer. Good call. Correctional officers are some of the most important frontline workers we have. Not only will you get a chance to make a difference in people's lives, you'll play an important role in serving your community. This video will help you understand the hiring process and learn how you can level up with CDCR. Before we walk you through the level up process, remember, becoming a correctional officer takes time. Our peace officer staff are made up of dedicated, hardworking men and women who have all been through this process. At any time, you can reach out to our team to help answer any questions you have. Are you ready? Okay, let's go. There are six important steps or levels that you will need to pass as you progress on your journey to becoming a correctional officer. First, there's your application, followed by a written exam, then a background check, a psychological evaluation, and a medical exam. And after that, you make the certification list and then it's off to the training academy. Hi, I'm Officer Devin Tovar, a recruiter with the CDCR. By now, you're either thinking about or have already applied to join our team. I remember when I first signed up 17 years ago, I was so unsure of what comes next. What do I need to do? Well, the hiring process is very different than when I first applied. So let's take a look at it. First, we'll need to make sure you meet the minimum qualifications. Don't get discouraged if you don't understand the process. We're here to answer your questions and help you figure out what steps to take if you still have any outstanding issues or concerns. Remember, you can contact our office during any stage of the process. We're here to help you all the way through the academy. Hi, I'm Officer Morena Mesa. Once you submit your application, you will be notified by email of the next step, your written examination. This exam will evaluate your basic knowledge in grammar, spelling, math, and other skills. We want you to succeed. The best way to prepare for your exam is to review the sample test on our website. Hi, I'm Sergeant Angela Martinez, a background investigator. It is crucial that our officers are fully vetted before they join the team. A background investigation is an essential part of this process. Your investigation will begin with you completing a personal history statement. This is an in-depth record of your personal information. This form is the foundation of our investigation. It's your chance to introduce yourself to our department, so we need you to be as thorough and accurate as possible. Our website, joincdcr.com, has a lot of resources to help you complete this document, so don't worry if it seems challenging at first. This may feel like a lot, but please understand that we must be fully confident in every one of our officers to ensure the safety of our staff and inmates. So we have to be thorough during this part of the hiring process. Greetings, I'm Dr. Diana Deeds with the Psychological Screening Program. I'm a licensed psychologist contracted by CDCR. As part of this process, you will take a psychological evaluation. Next, we'll schedule an oral psychological interview then we'll talk. I'll get to know more about you, to understand more about who you are. Now, this is a very important step because a healthy mindset is critical to performing your duties. Hey there, I'm Dr. Jean Wagner. On this level, you'll be given a series of tests including visual acuity, color vision, a hearing test, blood work, a drug screening, and a respiratory fit mask test. This will allow us to evaluate your overall physical ability to be a correctional officer. You've reached the last level. You will now be certified to hire. Once you reach the final level, you'll select your institution preference. We have over 30 locations across the state and the choice is yours. We cannot guarantee that the institution you want will have vacancies at the time you're ready to be hired but you'll make the ultimate decision on which location is right for you. Once you accept a job offer that meets your needs, we'll assign you to the next available academy. After that, you're on your way. Congratulations, you've leveled up. You're ready to become a correctional officer. But when you begin this process, remember, be patient. Becoming a peace officer is unlike any hiring process you may have experienced, and it's worth the wait. 
Not only do you make a difference for your community, but you earn a competitive pay and great benefits while doing it. Any questions? Just ask. We're here to assist and support you every step of the way on your journey to becoming a correctional officer in the California Department of Corrections and Rehabilitation. We look forward to welcoming you to our CDCR family.